So let's take a look at how you can create CSV file with Windows PowerShell. So I have a bind of Windows PowerShell ISC, or you can see integrated script editor, created one file name sample.ps, and here I'm going to create the first variable named CSV. Then going to use and the red symbol and then double quotes. Inside that, I'm going to use one column name ID and then value. Okay, after that, I'm just going to use let's see some of these values. Okay, so let's go ahead with some random values. After that, simply use to close that. So your variable should start with at the rate and end with at the rate with double quotes containing your CSV values. Next thing would be to check whether this works. So simply use CSV and when you call this variable CSV, you can then run this and you get your initial output okay what if you want to convert this output into actual csp file so for that simply use the csp variable then double two times operator for greater than symbol then path we want to make this appear okay now after this, you can simply run this. And if you get this prompt, that means file is created. You can verify by going to location. And here you see example two. Okay, now let's also see how to import and read this file. So remove this and simply type in import dash CSV and Rest is the path where you have your CSV file that we just created now. Run this, and here you see output that shows ID and value exactly the way we created. Okay, so this was a short demo on how you can create CSV file and how you can display that in PowerShell. I see.